Hey everyone, so this is the second part of my video where I just kind of show you guys how to actually load the ROM physically. Um, so by now, if you, you know, did the first part right, you should have the ROM on your SD card. You should have, you know, just dragged it to your SD card. Um, this one is booting up right now. It shouldn't be booting up. I just, you know, f turned it off for some reason. Um, and yeah, so I'm just waiting to boot up. Um, you know, say goodbye to your ROM. Um, you can probably get it back. And also, as a warning, that you do lose your apps with this. With, you know, flashing new ROMs. You do lose all your apps. You do lose your contacts. So there is, you know, that's pretty much the only downfall. Okay. And this is not the new ROM. This is my original ROM I've, I've started with. But this is a custom ROM, actually. This is CM7, so... I did a tour of that, so you guys probably already know what that looks like. Okay, power off. Um, and this is gingerbread, by the way. And I'm putting Froyo, so I'm kind of downgrading, but I'm upgrading because um, the ROM I'm putting on is actually faster and just a better ROM in general. Okay, turn off. But if you guys know a way that you can keep your apps, please tell me, because that would be very useful. Mm. Or just, you know, comment. Okay, so I'm gonna put my camera down, because <laughs> I've kind of failed it the past few times. Okay, so, what you're gonna do is, you press your volume, your power button, and then down on your power, uh, on your volume button. So down, down volume and power at the same time. And you guys are probably familiar with this, um, if you guys saw, like, it, they each booted that little thing thingamajiggy, um, I don't know. Then you just go down. Can you guys see that? Am I on my Mac? No, that's even more blurry. Okay, the second one is recovery, and you just use your volume button to navigate. So, you know, volume button, up and down. And then to, you know, click OK, just press your power button. Then I'll do HTC, and then you'll be in clock clockwork mod um ugh, didn't really show um okay and then you're just gonna want to do an android backup i don't really know what these things do but just do it anyway um they take a little bit there we go so now we're back at the home page and we're gonna go down to Wipe data factory reset. There we go. We just lost all our apps and stuff. Yay. Um, then you do wipe cache partition. Just wipe everything. Okay. Then you do advanced. Um, wipe Dalvik cache. Did it wipe? Okay. Um, then you're just gonna do, oops, wait, what the crap, it's a joke. Is this a joke? was disabled. Is this a joke? Like seriously. Okay, so now it's now it's there. And you're just gonna do install zip from SD card. Choose zip from SD card. I just wanna see if my I guess my back button's there. Um and it's liberated aria. I don't. It's the one that you put in your SD card. It's liberated aria, fr008 signed dot zip. Then you're just gonna do yes, and it'll do that thing. There we go. Okay, and then you're just gonna do go back, reboot. Oh, sorry, reboot system now. Then I'll just do its thing. That's a good sign. Then it goes to HTC. Okay. 
the first reboot back takes, or the first like boot of, on your new ROM takes a little bit. Just putting it out there. And then it'll change, and then it'll go to HTC, and then it'll spell quietly brilliant. If you're on the right ROM. There we go. Okay. <laughs> and also, what's taking its own? Um. Also, if you were gonna, if you were put Cyan again Mod Seven on your phone, you would also install the Google Apps file at the same time. If it doesn't work. You can install it at different times. I don't really know. But yeah, it worked for me when I did it at the same time. Okay, this is a joke. Here we go. I'm on AT and T, right? <laughs> it feels so weird being back on an HTC ROM. <laughs> oh, and this this ROM does support live wallpapers, and I will also in another video show you how to um, install the nexus s live wallpaper the kind of the one the new version of that on here so wait for that video because that's gonna be a good video okay seriously what's taking it so long oh it's doing the thing so that's pretty much it i'll do a tour of this rom but that's pretty much how you install it thank you for watching and goodbye